Hello guys, welcome to the second vlog. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to uh, change the port for SSH on Ubuntu 2204 server. So without further ado, let's begin this tutorial. Okay, so as you can see, I'm currently in the Ubuntu 2204 server interface. As you can see, I'm really logged in. So, let me just explain uh, real quick first what we're going to do and why we're doing it. So, normally, when you use SSH, you will use the standard port 22. Now, 22 is an okay port when you're accessing your machine locally. 22 is fine as it's the default and there's nothing really wrong with it when you're local on the network. However, if you want to, let's say, port forward it and access it remotely, it would not be advisable to have port 22, as this can cause security problems and you could potentially have your server broken into. It could be, you know, that's a, that is always, there's always um, a risk when using standardized ports. So what we're going to do, we're going to change the port. So something completely random that's about roughly five digits long. And this will make it harder to crack down and also just it's more secure. And it's also unique, so only you will know this specific port. So before we get started, we're just going to do sudo su. As you can see, I've already had my password typed in there, but if you did not get that prompt, you would have to type in your password first before accessing that. Anyway, we're just going to hit cd on that, and then hit clear on that. So what we're going to do first, uh, it's a very simple process, so we're just going to do nano slash cd, sorry, no, slash etc, slash ssh, slash sshd underscore config and then hit enter. And as you can see, we are once again in this um, in the SHD config file. Now, if you remember from the last video, we also tried to uh, access, we, we allowed root to um, uh, come on the system. As you can see, permit root login is set to yes. I can change that to no if I wanted to, but that's not the point of this video. The point of this video is to change the port. So as you can see over there, it says port 22. So what we're going to do now, we're going to uncomment this first. And we're going to type in five random digits. So I'm going to choose mine. Uh, and I'm going to make it 25347. So that will be my five digit port for SSH. I've got it noted down. And then we're going to use it. So all we need to do is control hit O to save. Control X to exit. Type in clear to get a nice clean interface, and then we're ready to move on. So the next step will be to restart SSH just to make sure that everything has worked correctly. So it is going to type in system CTL restart SSH. Click enter, and it's most likely restarted now. We can also just double check and see if it works. So system CTL status SSH. As you can see, it's all working. And as you can also see on, in the log, it says that it's server listening on port 25347. Also over here it says 25347. So now we're going to check. So if I was to go into my SSH client, as you can see over here, and then I'm just going to type in 192.168.1.93 and keep the default port of 22 there, click open you can see that nothing happens and it's going to kick us out. So we're going to have to close that and reopen it. However, if we're to do 192.168.1.93 again, so my IP address of the machine that is, and then do 25347 and then click on open. We click yes to trust the key or fingerprint rather. And you can see that I can log in as root with my password I just type that incorrectly, and as you can see, I am in the system, and that's it. Hopefully, this video has been helpful. If you would like to request a video, please leave a comment in the comment section below, or you can check out our Discord server, Twitter, and Instagram pages, which are the links in the video description. Thank you very much for watching.